Hey guys, in this video tutorial, we'll be learning about maturation and activation of macrophage. The macrophage is abbreviated as M5 and which is formed from the bone marrow cell through a series of pathways. Primarily, the bone marrow is formed in myeloid progenitor cell. From the myeloid progenitor cell, the granulocyte monocyte progenitor cell is formed, which gives rise to monocyte. And from the monocyte, the macrophages form. Uh, a cytokine plays a vital role to convert monocyte to macrophage, namely GMCSF, granulocyte macrophage colony stimulating factor. Okay. After the formation of macrophage, the macrophage have to go to activation and differentiation. Let me tell about different type of macrophage in different organs. It is microglia or macroglia which is formed in brain or CNS, central nervous system. It is also formed coffer cell in liver, osteoclast in bone and alveolar macrophage in lung. Okay, how macrophage is activated? Suppose a pathogen, suppose this is a bacteria and it has outer side manos component of uh, cell wall. Uh, this will be detected by the receptor present on the macrophage. Different type of receptor present in the macrophage, surface of cell surface of macrophage like scavenger receptor, manos receptor or uh, mic mac mac one integrin and this will interact with the molecule present on the surface of pathogen okay suppose there is a component manose on the pathogen it will interact with the manose receptor after interaction like you know amoeba which feeds uh, feeds in phagocytosis while taking its food exactly that type of movement will occur with the macrophage what happens the macrophage will detect uh, the macrophage first detect the pathogen then there will be a uh, chain up chain up mechanism where it will uh, it will totally surround the surround the uh, pathogen and phagocyte it. After phagocytosis, it will go through two process, two, no, two process, two types of process. Either that will be oxygen dependent or that it will be oxygen independent. Okay. In the oxygen independent, it will be goes through phagosome, lysosome pathway, and in oxygen dependent, different type of ROS. ROS particular will be involved. ROS is a reactive oxygen species. In the next video, we will be learning about how macrophages activated through